Howdy y'all, Push51 doing Let's Play Pokemon Training Card Game Part 39. Alright, in the last part we took on and defeated the icy gentleman by the name of Jack. And in this part we're going to be taking on the final member of the Grand Masters here by the name of Rod. Um, he likes to run what is known as the Dra uh, Legendary Dragonite deck, which contains Charizard, Gyarados, and Dragonite. Uh, the biggest thing is he has Water Energies and uh, 4 Dark Colors Energies, because um, Charizard takes any kind of energy and he can attack with but before that, gotta change the name of my deck again. Thanks again for the comments, guys. You you continue to impress me and <laughs> do a very good job. But we're gonna go with some uh, Chidori zero zero Rasengan zero zero suggested, and that was if I can remember it correctly. <laughs> was the Hydro. Symphony. Cause, I don't know, that just sounds epic to me. Like, I don't know how that exactly fits in with the electric type, but I just think it sounds epic anyway. Yep, there we go. <laughs> I guess we could also call it the Hydro Symphonia deck too, if uh, anyone else knows of that game. Alright, so let's get into this battle now. Basically, you have water electric types, let's see what I can do here. Nope, not that. <laughs> Is your deck ready, Bushy? Then let's begin the final duel. A one-match duel for six prizes. Grandmaster Rod, Legendary Dragonite deck. You know, actually, I was talking to um, my fans the other day, and he pointed out that uh, Rod looks a lot like Falconer from uh, Gold Silver. Just, I don't know, something that seems really cool. And I guess we start with a Poliwag. Oh boy, <laughs> one thing on the bench. Um, his Char's, his Charmander and Charmeleons might not be too big of a deal because the most he can do with um. Oh hey, and I got head sweet. Uh, the most he can do with Charmander or Charmeleon is uh, Scratch and Slash, respectively. Yeah, so this shouldn't be too big of a deal. Hopefully, I can kill his Pokemon before they evolve into like crazy, crazy beasts. Okay, so we're gonna use those two bills, draw some cards here. Drawing cards all over the place, and we're gonna use this water engine on the polywag, and we're gonna put down Electabuzz. Um, let's see. And I'm gonna hold on to that plus power. Actually, no, I'm not. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use one of these plus powers and attack with water gun, so I do 30 damage, so I can kill him in two hits instead of three hits. And hopefully, he doesn't get any of his uh, humongous Pokemon out here. Because, oh, okay, he's gonna switch to Dratini, I guess. <laughs> this might not be too good. Well, I don't know, because Dratini's really not that good. Like, neither is Dragonair. Only his Dragonite's really any good. Okay, Lightning Energy down to two Lector Burrs. Lector Beast. Um. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna use Energy Removal on, uh. Double Colorless Energy, because that's just obnoxious. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna attack with Water Gun again, I guess. Squirt him! Squirt him in his big white nose that looks like a... I don't know what... A sweet bun, I guess. Okay, he's so gonna put Magic up on the bench. And I guess he's gonna try and powering it up. Okay. Okay, I got another plus power. Um, I got two of these. Uh, let's hold on to those for now. Let's uh, add another Lightning Energy to Electabuzz. And attack with another water gun. So, pretty slow match so far, I guess. I didn't think he was going to switch out his Charmander. I thought he was just going to let it die. But, whatever. Alright, so we got another switch. Uh, I'm going to throw it on plus power, and I'm just going to attack with water gun. That's really all I can do right now. So, there you go. Bam! Dratini was defeated. So he's got like three more or whatever. I'm just gonna put out Magikarp. Not too worried about Magikarp since it's, well, a Magikarp. Oh, gonna be worried about Lat though, Lapras. Okay, his Magikarp. He's powering up his Magikarp, which I'm confused, but whatever. I guess he has Flail, but I don't know if that's really gonna help him much. Especially since I'm gonna kill him in one hit now. <laughs> Alright, so attach the water energy, so my water gun does 20 damage and plus power does 10 more, so therefore I'm gonna do 30 damage and kill it in one hit, like I just said. Sweet. Your efforts are futile! Alright, now he's gonna put out Lapras. This thing might actually take a little while to kill. Oh, and Professor O.K. That's interesting. 
Drawing cards all over the place. Oh, another Charmander. And another Magic Herb. Jeez. But he's next to attack. Okay, whatever. Fine by me. Okay, got another Elector Beast. All right. Um, finding energy down on him. Uh, how much does it take to retreat him? Oh, just one energy. Um, actually. Uh, <laughs> I think I'm gonna put a water. Oh, I can only blah blah blah. blah. All right, so I'm actually gonna use switch to get this Electabuzz out here, and I'm going to attack with Thunder Punch. Now let's see if I can kill a one hit or do 10 damage myself. Yes, I kill a one hit. Sweet. 80 damage. That's incredible for just a basic Pokemon. Okay, it's inside of Charmander, which I can also probably kill in one hit, maybe. I'm seriously surprised he hasn't been getting any of his strong Pokemon out. Well, I guess it's not really too big of a surprise since he uses a lot of change or whatever. Er, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna attack with, um... You know, let's just take the simple route. I don't want, uh, Electabuzz to end up killing itself or whatever. So, let's just attack it with, ah, uh, Thundershock. I want it to be more of a sure kill instead of, uh, me doing, like, 20 damage for myself. Okay, so he's gonna scratch me, and I guess that's pretty much it. <laughs> no big deal. Ooh, hey, Polyrath! <laughs> What's up? Alright, uh, letting the energy onto the other Electabuzz, and, you know what, let's go for a Thunder Punch, why not? Ah, dang, see, that's not, yeah, that's not what I didn't want to happen, I didn't want him to hurt himself, but, uh, I guess it doesn't really matter, I'm still pretty far ahead. Still power up that Magikarp. Maybe he's got a Gyarados, or he's, like, expecting one or something, I don't know. Okay, a little lightning energy, um gonna hang on to that. And I guess just attack with Thundershock. Paralysis! Not that it matters! Sweet. Pony! Oh, by the way, I don't know if anyone heard about this, but, uh, Pokemon Black and White came out recently. <laughs> and, um, I'm playing Black right now. Black is pretty amazing, but my main file is probably gonna be on my white version that I'm probably only gonna play when I get my 3DS. But, yeah, so far I've, I've been doing a pretty good job. I'm on my way to my sixth badge. I'm, like, literally standing right in front of the, uh, next gym. But, uh, I'm gonna put down that Voltorb and a Lightning Energy. And I don't know, what do you guys think about the new Pokemon or anything? Like, it, I think it's actually, they're all actually pretty cool. But, um, a lot of people complain about them. They're like, oh, they don't look like Pokemon anymore. Uh, whatever. Brr. But, I don't know. Alright, so we just gonna use Thunder for no drawback, really. Oh, and I paralyzed it anyway, sweet. So now it doesn't matter. <laughs> Another charm, Andrew, jeez. Man, he hasn't evolved anything yet. I'm surprised. He's halfway through his deck, too. Jiggles! Um, let's throw down another water energy onto Poliwag. Just, actually, no, it's not. Um... Let's put Jigglypuff down. Water energy out of Jigglypuff, just in case if I have to use, uh, what's his face? Wigglytuff. Alright, whatever. Paralysis doesn't matter when you have to kill a Magikarp, because Magikarps are kind of stupid fish anyway. Plus power. Am I really gonna beat him and he's gonna show off none of his cards? Are you serious right now? That's really lame. Like, really lame. That's sad. Uh... Was he on his bench anyway? Charmander? Oh, two Charmanders. Oh, that's a Charmander that I still haven't killed yet. You know what? Uh, Gust of Wind. I guess. Let's get... This is so anticlimactic, because he's supposed to be, like, the toughest one. Whatever. That's so sad. That's why this game is always based on luck. This is so ridiculous. Uh... Whatever. My god, I didn't lose a single prize against him. That's so sad. I... I almost feel like I don't- I shouldn't post this video because it's just pathetic of him. Well, hey! Looks like we beat the Grand Masters! Alright, so that's pretty much the end of the game, right? Well, what? On Earth? Even I, Rod, have been defeated! Wonderful! This is wonderful! Congratulations, Bushy! You've proven yourself worthy to inherit the legendary Pokémon cards! Except... We have a problem. There is another who has defeated us. You must duel him. Yeah, that's right! It's me, Ronald! 